Hi everyone, um, this is a, uh, I'm going to be starting a new game for the Last Stand Union, this will be Survival Mode, or Survivor Mode, so, City. Oh, good. I kind of look like sure like that from GTA Five. <laughs> yeah, I'll tell you that. I'm gonna have. Oh, oh, good. Is that Star Cities? All right. Uh, facial hair. I want a big long beef. Yeah, <laughs> like that. Okay. Um. My occupation. I'll be a martial artist type. Um, okay. Alright, I'm back. So, that was a little bit of a title sequence. I thought it was pretty cool. I wanted to get silent for you guys. That way you could enjoy it. So, now, I don't know the difference between survivor mode and normal mode. So, we'll just have to find out, I guess. Alright. Alright, okay, let's see this. Alright, so... Pit, that was my primary. But that was my secondary. Alright. So, if you guys haven't seen my other beginning starting playthrough for the other mode, I would recommend watching it. Um, so... I don't know, there's just something about this game. Um, I'm going to be posting a Organized Thief either today or tomorrow. I haven't decided yet. Um, one thing I noticed, if you've watched my other playthrough, sorry for the lagging, by the way, my computer's a little, it's an old laptop, so, um, but,
something that you might want to, if you play this game, um, is the guns aren't very effective to the zombies, and you should only use the bullets, like, you, you'll end up with a lot of bullets if you look, because usually there's a lot of bullets, but, uh, I would, um, just don't use them the gun is often unless you really have to like when there's tough zombies or something because they sometimes miss a lot so um, yeah you'll miss you'll miss the zombies because it has a mode and I don't know whether you have to position it right or if it's just the way it is. So, alright, let's go back downstairs. Okay. Alright. So, I am not noticing any differences so far. But I do hear a zombie. Sorry about that. Oh. oh. Yeah. Oh, what's that? Look how stupid you are. Oh, now you're gonna punch me. See, you should have done that earlier. See, don't be stupid and keep talking. Just do something. Just, you always do something. Those zombies are too stupid to know what they're doing. Sometimes. I'm sorry, I just moved in. Are you one of the neighbors? I guess that doesn't matter now. You're safe here. This all started a few days ago. People just start killing each other. The ones that killed, the ones they killed didn't dead. Stay here and rest up. I've got Sarah and Peter from next door staying in my room stairs. You're welcome to sleep on the floor if you need to. Alright. Oh, storage. I forgot all about the... Um, if you guys didn't know... Um, my first playthrough, I was in here, um, my first playthrough when I was in, when I was doing this game, um, on the other mode, I came in, what I did is I, uh, I came in here and I forgot all about it that there was a store in here to, to, to put stuff in. Um, so, <clears throat> oh, that looks like Peter and Sarah, I remember these guys, oh, you're not one of them, thank God, Jackson was enough to take us in, he secured the place as best he could, I don't think they're getting in, they, they hear, <sighs> Excuse me. In here anytime soon. My husband has lost it. He wants to leave. I think it's best to stay here and wait this thing out. Right? Anyway, good luck finding a way. So I'm assuming this is her husband over here in the corner. Which is Peter. Yep. Oh God, oh God, oh God, why won't they stop? Why is this happening? They already took my kids. What do they want from me? We have to leave. We have to leave. The, the bags are packed and ready. We can go. We can leave. We can go now. I wouldn't go off there if I were you. I mean, feel free to. Okay, what's a broken pen gonna do for me? A tissue for crying into. Cause, cause that's so 
going to help me. Alright, back downstairs. Back down the stairs we go. Yeah, I really see a difference in this compared to the other mode. I don't know if there's something else or what. Alright. Well, let's go see if those won the first part are by the fence still. Taste kitchen knife. Oh god, that's really ineffective. Um, um, lead pipe. Or, no, that's a tire iron. Oh crap. <gasps> Beat him up. Punch him. Oh god. Ah! 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 What is this? I think I have a flashlight. I wonder if they can see me from my flashlight. Um, I'm not sure they can or not. Anyway, I'm gonna beat you over the head. Yeah, that's right. Stand there mocking me. You zombies think you're so tough. See, you're no match for the power of my magical tire iron. Beat you over the head with it. Well, judging from this game, if you ever, if there's ever a zombie apocalypse, please do hit the zombies over the head with a tire iron. And if it's a Sharknado, grab your boss. Ah, 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 turn around. I almost messed up there. Okay, so I see no difference in this mode. Um, from what I can, from what I've played, there's really no difference to this mode. Um, from what I can see, um, but I will definitely keep looking to see if I can find anything else at all, if it's just, so, um, yeah, um, so, uh, is, that's about it, that pretty much wraps it up for now, I think, for this playthrough, uh, I will be doing... Oh. Nice! We can all smoke when there's a zombie apocalypse. So. Alright, everyone. Well, I think that pretty much wraps it up for the through. Um, I will be looking in to see if there's a difference at all. Um, so far, it looks the same. I, I'll have to look into it again. But. I will see you guys in the next playthrough. And as always, stay tuned for more.